Welcome back to Fun Labs Design Studio. In the last video, I went over some tips and tricks in Krita for the painting. Um, using my Lady Deathstrike concept character design for reference for all these tips and tricks for right now, um, as it's the one that I'm working on to complete. I haven't been able to come on in a while, sorry about that. I've been working on some client projects and I was working on The Last of Us, helping and lighting for the new series that's coming. I apologize for that. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, chocolate and coffee, very good. Mocha. Anyway, so for this video, I already cleaned it all up. And I added the detail that I wanted to, the accents. Cleaned up all the line work, shadows, whatnot, um, the skin tone. But what I'm trying to do now is apply the background. So clean up this transparency here because it appears to be transparent but it actually isn't so and I'll show you what you do is you go over to the contingency selection tool here no. you select it and you click here and you'll see all the green and fuzziness from the pencil from the paper that I tried to get out as much as I could before but for some reason it just didn't get out you're not able to select it and then use the brush tool with eraser selected and just go over it to erase I don't know why I don't it that would be super cool if someone could develop that for Krita because it would be way more efficient productive wise productivity wise so in order to deselect now you go control shift a and you can erase now, like I can make my brush bigger and then now it's and it's selected the eraser tool by selecting E and I can go over it and you'll see when I select it again with the contingency selection tool. Crazy fool. You'll see it's gone. So I can do it that way. But then you have to like zoom in, kinda of goof around. So what I'm gonna do is show you a better way to be able to um, get rid of all that. You can use a digital tablet if you want, or you can use your mouse. Either one will work for this. Probably gonna use my mouse for this. So what you'll do is you'll go over to this tool here, which is the Bezier Curve Selection Tool. And you'll see that it has the uh, half circle line work. You can select a contingency hey, selection Angel. tool, and then select your area. And then you go in with your Bezier Curve Selection Tool and you can click and kind of select and pull and shape. Kind of like a pen tool, if you're ever familiar with a pen tool from any other programs that you may use, like Photoshop or Illustrator. So you can kind of go around and you add slow, but what it will do for you is get all that done in one instead of farting around, trying to find it, zooming in and out, and all this nonsense. Um, I'm sure there's other ways. I've tried selecting and then pressing delete just like you would in Photoshop. Uh, the contingency selection tool, almost like a mini magic wand. Um, I've tried that, but it doesn't work so and then to move you can just hold the space bar as you're moving and then it moves the hand so you're just clicking kind of in place where you want it to be and if you're using the pen from your tablet you can just tap on the tablet to mark where you select your point so i'm just gonna go and do a little rough here and then just show you that you can instead of selecting the whole thing and taking like super long with the video I just want to do a quick one here a quick little selection of this area so I'll pause the video clean it all up and then what I'll do I'll apply the background and then I'll be done and then I'll probably be on the store so there you go you can select it like that and then you select the brush tool and then it's selected eraser, so B for brush. You can blow up the brush tool with your 
brackets and E to select um, erase and then go along and do just erase and you won't go over your lines see so you're not going to ruin anything outside that line so it's kind of like a protective barrier for your art art your art work there a bye there a bye that's how uh, Newfie's talking in East Coast Canada. I love you, Newfie's. So, they sound better. More Scottish, Irish type. <laughs> so, there we go. Now that one's done, and then we're gonna zoom out. And then what I'm gonna do is control, press Control Shift A again, deselect. And then continue Are you to select kind again. Of moron? And just click. And now you'll see all that's gone. And it was cleaner, easier to do, much nicer, and straightforward. What I'll do is just uh, clean all that up, come back, and then I'll add the. <coughs> I will add the background that we did in the first video, image editing. Thank you very much. Stay tuned here.